So if you are looking for a place for the kids to get out and enjoy their fall break, the Kentucky Science Center is bringing back their pay by day camps for the whole first week of October. So if you need something for the kids to keep them busy, this is it. Joining me now with more on this is Taylor Ucellis to tell us all about this, right? Like I feel like um, we do summer and spring breaks and all the travel. A lot of people do opt to have like a staycation here at home, enjoy the beauty of Kentucky, yep. but we need to keep our kids busy. That's right. And you guys are to the rescue. Yeah, <laughs> we can do that for you. <laughs> yeah, definitely. I mean, and, and you're having it like a good amount of time too. Yes. Yeah, so we're doing our pay by day camps October 2nd to the 6th, which is the entirety of JCPS's uh, fall break, which is new this year, yeah. right? JCPS had a, a fall break last year, but it was only a few days long. And this year it is actually a whole week. Yeah. And so while you might take a vacation, you know, you might go somewhere for a couple of days, it would be nice, right? To have somewhere to put your kids for yeah. the other parts of that week. And so these pay by day camps are perfect for that because you can send them for one day or you can send them for the whole week. And it's fun for, for everybody involved. Sample it out. And you've yeah. just got lots of different lanes for people to try out yes. because science is not one size fits all. There's just so many different avenues and you can find the avenue that your kid likes. Yep, that's right. So we actually have um, three different levels of camp that accommodate from pre-K all the way up until fifth grade. So no matter what age your child is, there should be something for them at the Science Center. And some of my favorite things about the camps are um, the low student to teacher ratio. And so you know your, your kid oh, is getting the, the attention they need, but also the hours that work with the parents working schedule we are 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. so you don't have to worry That's about picking right. your kids yeah. up early and then lastly the curriculum of the camps actually matches uh, the curriculum of JCPS That's and great. so you know when your kid is in our camp that learning is gonna keep going um, but the fun might ramp up just a little bit and um, <laughs> And also a great time too, just to go to the camp, but also a great time just to visit too, to, yes. if you're not able to do the camp, but just to get out there. I know you all have like new permanent exhibit that you're excited to show off. So it's a great time to check that out. That's so true. So um, you get entrance to the science center um, when your kid is at the science camp. And so you can come check out our new exhibit, Uniquely Human. And we also just got a new dinosaur bone. So Yay. that's kind of fun yeah. too. <laughs> Always nice when you guys yeah. get new additions to everything. Sure. What is the price breakdown for, for the camp, like pay by day versus pay for the whole week? Yeah, so it's $70 per day if you're a member of the Science Center and $80 per day if you're not. And then you just add those days up throughout the yeah. whole week and that's Still the week a great, price. great deal. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. Yeah, we so uh, and then where can we go for more information if we, we want to sign up? Sure. It's kysciencecenter.org and you'll see a little button on the very home page, on the very front home page that says camps. Right. Do you all get so excited when you get to kind of plan, you know, let's have yes. a wizarding, wizarding world. Let's have monster makers. I mean, I can only yes. ima imagine the strategy <laughs> sessions kind of going into, oh, and this is what we can build curriculum wise around it. That's it's fun. so great. And we have a really deep curriculum of camps too. So it's fun to see them change each year mm -hmm. and determine what's cool and fun that year. And then of course, it's fun to see the kids at the Science Center. So the, that week, the, the Science Center will be a little more alive than it, than it is yeah. on a given week when everyone else is in school, you know? Right. So. And so will the kids be placed into a class that is just like kind of their age range? Yes. Or are they with a variety of different ages? Yeah, thanks for asking. Um, so we have pre-K to K, so that's four to five-year-olds, okay. okay. and then um, K to second, kindergarten to second grade, and so that's your five to seven-year-olds, and then we have third to fifth grade, which mm. is eight to 11-year-olds. It's a good breakdown. So yeah, they'll be grouped into sort of like minded ages yeah. so that they're with their peers when they're learning and have that great time with the the teacher the leader as well because yep. of those ratios are so low for well, sure Taylor great to see you yeah thank oh, you it's almost here I can't believe I feel like we just started school so and here we are so uh, to, to sign up for any of those camps and see whether a daily fit is good or just day by day or for the entire week or if you just want to drop by just go to kysciencecenter.org